clears the field for the fifth race. The Windy Skeeter for Illinois Conceived and Fold three-year-old trotting fillies. One is Perfect Tradition. On by John McMahon of Saratoga Springs, New York. Irvin Miller trains. Andy Miller drives. Perfect Tradition. Two Miss Ivy League. On by Bill Wright, Dirk Simpson, and Don Coleman of Illinois. Dirk Simpson trains. Brent Holland is up. Three big old Ruby Redress. The two-year-old champion. Owned by Steve Newcomb of Chicago. Tex Moach trains. Dave McGee in the bike. Four Moms Jubilee, owned by Junior Harold of South Roxana. Ray Hanna trains. Eric Ledford will drive. Five Vivacious Victory, leased by Sonny Graham of Salem. Sonny Graham trains, owned by Bill and Ann Gross. And Dale Heitman is in the bike. Six Madeline Marshall, owned by Crawford Standard Bread Farm Inc. of Crawfordsville, Indiana. Ken Crawford, the trainer, Dan Shetler, is up. Seven, La Rapida, owned by Homer Hochstetler of Crete. Bruce and Dean Alexander of Wisconsin. Homer Hochstetler trains and drives. Eight, Tough Kim, owned by Lily Racing Stable. By Dixie Graham of Chicago and Salem. Jerry Hansen trains Tony Morgan in the bike. Nine, Edict, owned by P.H. Stable of Luxembourg. By William Valiant of Loyal, Illinois. Joe Anderson trains. Per Henriksen gets the call. And number 10, Meadow Branch Pat, owned by Neil Miller of Beverly Hills, California. Tony Alanya trains and drives Meadow Branch Pat. They're at the post, and the gate is rolling. Here they come. They're off and trotting from the outside. There goes La Rapida for the lead. Big old Ruby Red Dress is out well. She's second to the inside. Perfect tradition away third. Out four, Miss Ivy League. Five, Madeline Marshall. Six, middle of racetrack is Vivacious Victory. Getting out seven. Dropped in covered there now is Mom's Jubilee. Away next as they swing around the turn, trotting toward the uh, backstretch. And backed up now to be uh, eighth is Vivacious Victory as they're headed toward the quarter mile mark. Racing with the lead, La Rapida, second there is big old Ruby Red Dress on the inside, trotting third as they race past that mark toward the uh, backstretch. Racing third on the inside is big old, uh, and down the backside to the uh, half mile mark, still third to the inside is Perfect Tradition. On the outside, easing up Edict, she has moved up from fifth to be fourth, now third, as La Rapida leads them off a 28 three quarter toward the half mile mark. On the inside, big old Ruby Red Dress enjoying the trip. Second on the outside, Edict is being aired. Third, four is Perfect Tradition. Five, Miss Ivy League. Six underway is Mom's Jubilee behind her. Vivacious Victory is next. Racing on the outside, Meadow Branch Pat is next. Tough Kim is nine at the back of the field. Madeline Marshall, the half mile mark in 57-2. They're in the final turn and leading the way now by a length and a half as they head toward three quarters is La Rapida. Behind her, big old Ruby Red Dress ready to move from third. Perfect tradition and ranging up on the outside now from way, way back and moving into contention fourth comes Vivacious Victory. They're at the three-quarter to the outside. Here comes Big O' Ruby Red Dress. Perfect Tradition will follow her. Vivacious Victory will need to sweep way wide. They race past that mark with La Rapida, 126 for top of the lane. On the inside, La Rapida on the outside. Here comes Big O' Ruby Red Dress. And outside her, Perfect Tradition. The battle develops between Phillies. Big O' Ruby Red Dress on the inside. La Rapida hanging tough and no place to go across the racetrack now for Vivacious Victory. They drive to the wire. Here here comes a vivacious victory. Vivacious victory wins it. La Rapida two, big old Ruby Red Dress three, Meadow Branch Pat four, 157-2. Vivacious victory finally found room, but that's a photo finish. That's a photo finish. Hold all tickets. Bill Gross, who owns the Philly, patiently waits along with his sister and Gross Friedley. And lessee, trainer, nationally prominent Sonny Graham, equally anxious. And the wait is over. Ladies and gentlemen, winner of the Windy Skeeter, vivacious victory, Dale Heitman.
vivacious victory. The Valley Victor filly from Noble Luge by Bobsled, bred by Bill Gross. And the red hat, his sister Ann Gross Friedley is there. And now presentation of the race trophy by the Illinois Director of, of Agriculture from Windsor, Illinois, Mr. Joe Hampton. Hampton himself, with a uh, strong background in livestock, appreciates the horse and appreciates the people that race horses. A supporter of the harness racing program in the state of Illinois, and we thank you, Joe Hampton, for your participation and your interest. Last second surge carries this filly to the $17,500 payoff. Her mother, Noble Luge, was a great race mare, a two-minute trotter, multiple two-minute winner for the Gross family. And now the Noble Luge daughter, the Valley Victor filly, vivacious victory. After that patient drive by Dale Heitman, the champion, 